In this example, uh, we're going to evaluate the limit analytically using direct substitution. Okay. Um, so in this case, uh, we can use another one of those properties uh, from the of the limit. Okay. Um, using this one, if you right, if we have the limit as x approaches c of some function. Okay. Let's say raised to some n power, then this is equivalent to the limit as x approaches c okay for a function all raised to the n power okay all right so applying that here okay so in this case n uh, for this particular example n is going to be one half since we right because we have the square root here so we can rewrite this as the limit as x approaches 2. Okay, so we have, so basically we have uh, 2x squared plus 1 all over 3x minus 2 to the power of 1 half. Okay, so this is the same as taking the limit as x approaches 2 of 2x squared plus 1 divided by 3x minus 2, and all this is raised to the power of 1 half, okay? All right, and then, so then using another property of limits, we can, we can split this up, right? We have the limit of the ratio. So we can take the limit of the top part and divide by the limit of the bottom part, okay? And all that's gonna be raised to the 1 half. Okay, so we have the limit As x approaches 2 of 2x squared plus 1, okay, divided by the limit as x approaches 2 of 3x minus 2, okay. And all this is going to be raised to the power 1 half. All right. So from here, we can go ahead and just use the, uh, we can go ahead and use direct substitution. Okay, so for the numerator, okay, we're gonna get, uh, so we evaluate 2x squared plus one at two. Okay, so that's gonna give us nine. Okay. All right, so, so we get nine in the bottom. We have the limit of three x minus two as x approaches 2, so that's going to give us 4, okay, and then all this is raised to the 1 half, okay, uh, that's the same thing as taking the square root, all right, so this is going to leave us with 3 halves, okay, all right, so that is the solution to this limit, okay.